Hi guys, my name is Bank Mwalimu. I'm a student leader at University of Nairobi. I'm also a student. I am a content creator uh, from Liz and Mac, and uh, I'm also an entrepreneur. I also run a cyber. And uh, this is my girlfriend. Hi, my name is Liz Nduko. I'm a student at the Cooperative University of Kenya. I'm an entrepreneur, I'm a baker, and, a, and also a content creator from Liz and Mac. And, and this, this is, is our, our love story. story. We met uh, six years ago, and uh, that was in 2016. At that time, uh, to form three, and uh, there's a tuition that to uh, lienda mahali, and we we happened to find ourselves in the same tuition. Siko na mjua by the way, Mimi actually. So that was my first time kumuona. So I saw I saw this uh, very um, like uh, quiet lady, a menyamaza, aonge na watu. I think she was shy, and so. Mimi kumuona tu like siku an idea that maybe at some point we could ku date but we just started talking then simply pole pole tu tukaanza ku grow interest of each other so we started even planning kwenda library pamoja and such kind of because after to talk tuition we'll go to library so that is how we met and uh, the funny thing is that we met 6 years ago but we started dating around 1 year and a half years ago so uh, it has taken us time and um, so where it all started is uh, I one day after tuition she was going to the library and uh, so she she texted me that time alikuwa na kabambe mindo nilikuwa na nini mindo nilikuwa na smartphone so everybody would use my smartphone kupiga picha taking selfies and everything <laughs> Yeah, so um, she texts me and tells me. So she was she used a word, akasema, um, uh, akaniambia that to nezenda library. So the funny thing when uh, when when we are, we were going to library uh, somewhere there in Buruburu, tukafika donum, and then she's like, ah, my friend kuna kitu amesau nyumbani na alikuwa anataka ni niende. So I was like maybe she's not ready because sasa tumefika katikati and then she's going back because you used to trek so mi nikasaba ni sawa let me go alone so i went to the library then that evening she texts me ananiambia pole babe nilikosea <laughs> so i was like babe imetoka wapi <laughs> so that is where it all started so um i i started maybe having feelings towards her we we talked kidogo i tried to mkatia kidogo and then now that was uh, form 3 ndilikuwa holiday ya, t- ya August. So when it came to January now f- uh, tukaenda tukarudi shule that's after now August uh, tukanyamaziana. So she ghost she ghosted me for almost a year. So that was now 29 20 2017 2017 tukio form 4. Mm. Akapotea sasa mimi nikashindwa. I used to look for her sikuweza nampata. So yeah, I think Yeah, so fast forward to 2018. Mm. is when I looked for you, yeah? Mm. So I texted him, and uh, like, who cut you who? <laughs> Say your story. <laughs> mm-hmm. So when I texted him, I think we kind of started dating, but mm-hmm. it wasn't that serious, because we wouldn't even see each other. It was just regular text calls and all that. So a big part of 2018, then we were on and off, on and off. Like, mm. I wasn't sure what I was doing, so I used to break up wi- with him a lot, a lot, a of, lot times. of times. Yeah, mm, that's right. yeah. After some few days, I'm like, no, we can't do this. Let's just stop it. And then, na- in Asia, even then, after mm-hmm. some time, I come back. I'm like, ah, oh, maybe we can. not So yeah, it was on and off for a while. And then, mm-hmm. just before we went to college. I cut it off completely, yeah. Mm. I wanted to focus on studies and all that. So yeah, we broke up and everyone went their separate way mm. ways, but we were still friends. We were still good friends. So when we went to campus now, I think you can continue from there. To Rudy twenty eighteen. <laughs> <laughs> twenty eighteen actually. Uh-huh. Um this lady is an invited this lady <laughs> because at now we are in twenty eighteen. So to kill twenty eighteen, um she cut off everything. Because I tried dating her for around three, three, 
two, three, four times. And every time she would come with an excuse, oh, this has happened, please let's stop dating. And me, for my side, I was very serious, like, I loved this lady. Okay, in my defense, mm. like, I was young, I was very young, I didn't think I was ready for dating. Mm -hmm. Okay, most people would say at 18, at 19, you are ready, but I wasn't, I felt mm -hmm. like I was so young. So, like, it was a thin line. Okay, me on my side, I was very ready, and I really like wanted to date this lady. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, like me, I try to push. I because that time I was in uh, I was in up country. I was teaching in a school somewhere, and I used to take off even to come to Nairobi to mm -hmm. meet her. But uh, once to me plan a meet up, she will just disappear. Singe muona, <laughs> and yeah like really hard and at this point okay narudi nyumbani nikirudi nyumbani sasa ndiye anani text na tunaanza ku vibe tena <laughs> so when I am near Nairobi she would not like she would cut communication and it was a bit like so much hurtful to me at I'm all sorry. this time <laughs> <laughs> all this time i'm trying like to just push at least nipende umschana but at the same time she's trying to push me away at some point like i would really even go to their home to their place there's a time nilienda hata kwa Kwao, I found her small sister, I don't know if you came to greet me or you, you didn't come. So, I like, can. they were just back and forth, back mm -hmm. and forth. So, it happened, like, I'm trying to push, but here, yeah, attack you, kuingia box. So, this time, to go 2018. And remember, we met in 2016. So, 2018, I got into college. Uh, when I started college, the idea was to focus on studies and all that. So, it was not really important for me to be in a relationship or things like that, you know. But somehow, <laughs> I found myself in one and it was not really good. Mm. It didn't end well. So, I started reaching out to him. Mm. Yeah, you know. Yeah, true. I started reaching out to him after mm. after that relationship ended and then we became good friends. We were talking for a while. Mm -hmm. And now, was it 2020? Mm, it was in 2020. So 2020, I really wanted to rekindle things between us. So I reached out to him uh, for a meetup. Mm -hmm. But on the day we were supposed to meet, Uli, you were busy, right? Yeah. That I was, was uh, busy, and then the next mm. day I got sick, and then I was admitted in hospital. So mm. for around four days. He so came. just just to cut you short there, mm -hmm. um, at this point, year 2018, it was right before Corona. So Mimi, at some point, kwa nisha fika nisha give up, nisha yeah. sema like manzi udem atawai atawai nikubali. So what I can do is, uh, let me just like stay away in mm. a way that maybe nezaonyesha na mpenda but I don't want to be so much into her because she might hurt me na mimi nilikuwa naumia sana so I used to like talk to her because every time we make any plan aingeenda through at all at all like mm. ingekuwa like we are not we are not so much in conversation and I'm like sasa hey kweli try to date so mimi nilikuwa naogopa sana na sema let me just put it to myself. I don't want to expose myself so much out there to her because at the end of the day, Mimi don't end up with me. So I ended up like telling her, like, see, I don't see if we'll ever date, but in as much as Mimi Takwana said, Malinaweza. So this day that she's calling me, maybe she was, she wanted to talk to me, but Mimi, at your time, we had a lot of campaigns and school, so we were not so much like, um, like, like, like contacting, nini, nini, tungeongea tu once in a while, and then we stopped talking. So when now we ro got to that day that she, she wanted to see me, mimi nika, nika bail out. Like, I, I, had, I was busy, but I put the, the, the plan, nikidhani, like, nikiwa tuna ile idea that atuta, atuta meet. So, like, nilikuwa najua tu every time tungeenda, tunge plan ku meet, atungeza ku meet. So at this point, na feel, ah, I, there's no need of me attaching so much to her. So me nika call off that and uh, nika I am busy. So she went ahead sasa. From there sasa maybe that is my defense. Like the reason siku anataka kumwana hiyo siku. We started talking. You went we went home because of COVID. Mm. It was that first wave of corona. So he yeah, went, yeah, yeah. He went mm. back home mm -hmm. to Shags and then I was in Nairobi. So we started talking like more often mm. and so I had the idea, like, 
I did want to date him, but I was not so sure because I was sure like he had moved on because I had broken his heart so many times. Too Manzi many alikuwa times. Manzi, sana. <laughs> <laughs> alikuwa meniumiza sana. At some point, ilifika manzi nikona. W what is the, like, what is the problem with me? Ni mimi so nikona shida. On. Siku move on, like, I was trying to put feelings to myself because at some point, nikuwa na feel, eh, kwani, what did I do? Because, like, I was so much into her, but at the same time, she got to campus, then she got a, a boyfriend. So I was like, Siku okay, jua. in my defense, mm. with you, I felt like I was not ready to date. Like, I was not ready. But you were ready with the other person. No, it's not like I was ready. <laughs> <laughs> so that I was coerced. And then she was, she used to hide everything from me. So, at a yo time, you had to a girl boyfriend. Like, at a kiaka status, she used to hide me. So, there's this time, actually, the, the, the villain, how I knew that you were dating, there's this time that you texted me. Uh, I mean, ulikuwa nataka usaidizi something to do with an email. And then you send me your email and your uh, and your password. So I You're don't so know. You so nosy. No, I was not nosy. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Uh -huh. There's something you wanted me to do and send through your email. Uh -huh. to, I don't know which email you wanted me to send to. Sikumbuki. Uh -huh. So I happened to open the email. And then in my scrolling to Nikitaka kukompose. Una compose email. Nikitaka kukompose an email. Kwa sent box yake, nikaona a, 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 a big, it's a small, it's, it's it a placard. Sijui na itwa nini, I just along, along nini, imetengenezwa. Ikona picha boyfriend hapa, na girlfriend hapa, a very good one. And then imeandikuwa how I met you, how I have felt towards you. And then the funny thing is that, unona kwa hiyo nini? Kwa hiyo, kwa hiyo the whole text, there's something in ilikuwa, ilikuwa tu ili, kitu ili nyuthi. Hata si hiyo <laughs> tenini, hiyo malavidavi na nini. Kitu ili niuma ni alisema, hakuwa mependa mtu before she met that person. Jitete, because that is what you said. That is what you said, sindi yo? Yeah, so akasema, like, hakuwa me, hakuwa meona anybody, like, right before we met. So I was like, kai. So fast forward to 2020, we were mm -hmm. supposed to meet, but we didn't. COVID happened. Everyone was at home. I, I know you guys remember the anonymous thing, like Kubol. Nito Kubol, I mean, yeah, it's Kubol. I remember the the one that you used to nini unayaka status and then okay, people. Okay, you write on your status, uh, write me an anonymous message, message. Yeah. and then you won't know who wrote it. Mm -hmm. So everyone was doing it. I did it. He did it. Um, he wrote a message to me. You, I wrote a message to him, but like I'm the one who started the nini, I'm the one who put the the link out there first, Tama. Before me, yeah. or before, non, before or you, before, before me, you did it. Uh, mm. Yeah. So mm. on his status, mm -hmm. there's there's a girl who had written, <laughs> at the high mark, um, you you seem and look to be like a very good husband and a father figure. Ebu nita kutafuta ni maisha yiki songa songa. Alikuwa mesema? Nita kutafuta 2029. Oh, eh, alikuwa mesema. And she might watch this. Aka sema nita kutafuta yoma. But the, and that really caught me. Like, mm -hmm. I was like, wow. But I was an husband material. Of course. And I'm okay, still a... Okay, you are. <laughs> you are. You are. You are. You are. You But mm. yeah, so that was like, that was what m uh, made me to start think about it because mm. honestly I was mourning like your loss and then one thing I was afraid of I was like if I shoot my shots definitely like okay there's a higher percentage of you not like accepting me because mm. of what I've put you through but I said like it's better to try and fail than to fail to try mm. so mm. I reached out to him we were still talking very very often mm. so Nika Mwambia okay look I think we can try it again but that's all on you. If you don't want to, I do not mind, but I understand. She called the shot. <laughs> 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 Definitely, I, I yeah, shoot my is. shot. I, I did my best <laughs> for three three years. For three years. That's why I'm going to get a credit. I'm going to get a credit. I shoot my shot. Well, it's our. It's When she now like tell, told me that like she can date me, I was like, ah. Uh. So mean, in my mind, let me let like, me I'm ready. But... I'll tell you. Let me think about it. Let me think <laughs> about it. So I thought about it for almost a month plus and she's like, 
one night she texts me and akanambia aki uliamua tu utanipenda kabisa like we are not going to do this and I'm Did like, I do that? Yeah there's a night you texted me ukanambia like there's something you talked about ukasema like sasa ulisema we will never date me nini nini and that touched me nikasema let me just give this lady a, a chance mimi nikampea a chance kumpea a chance bado ako na uoga so i was like you're the one who, who has come so then umeanza kuogopa I, i never knew about it so like tukakaa hivi this was now in may so tukakaa kaka kidogo hivi hivi like we are just like oh let's do it let's do it pole pole then now came july 18th that is our anniversary july 18th that is when now we decided let's do this i did plan something i kamtengenezea ka kitu i sent her a gift and then i told that the gift one mandika let's do this so that's now when we started dating officially, officially. and uh, since then it has been a nice um, experience with her and it has been amazing mm. there are so many memories Uh, I think the mikiki nbia because I'm so happy because we have done a lot and uh, w- like just remembering for the last one and a half years um, my We've my hi- so neto hiccup I mean like my highlight of everything just before I say like some of them is mm-hmm. um us like doing a vacation together um like boarding plane for the first time <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that was like that was that was the highlight uh, mm-hmm. there's a time we did a vacation in Mombasa it was amazing um doing it together us starting businesses together us like there's there's a lot like there's a lot that uh, we have had for our best moments and even when we are communicating like it is just like Yeah, sometimes I'm very low things are really running so like fast in my life maybe things are going south but when she comes and holds my hand and tells me like let's do this and this it's possible I feel re-energized so like I've had so many memories uh, and um, I'm glad I'm glad maybe now maybe you can say about yourself okay my highlight was our anniversary Oh, it yeah. was nice mm-hmm. like it was our one year anniversary but it felt like we've been dating for so long because mm. we had achieved so much in one year mm-hmm. like we were so like as in we were not only celebrating one year of dating mm-hmm. but we were also celebrating us as different people you know we've mm-hmm. grown in this relationship we've gone into different ventures like he said mm-hmm. we have we have definitely grown it was it was amazing like we didn't do much but the reflection of one year mm-hmm. one year in a relationship it was yeah. great yeah i a youtube channel also yeah, our yeah. youtube channel growing has started the business and she was like i quickly to make but i came and hold her hand she also helped me she pushed me also even to go into leadership and like it has just been amazing yeah, yeah. Mm. one thing that i can tell people is that um, okay for me i don't really believe in love at first first sight maybe some, some people believe it out there but i believe in before love there is attraction yeah. and there is that feeling of this this person can be important to my life because i just you just don't love somebody out of nowhere no, no. so i feel like um for the young couples or if you are you want to date like take time take time and take time. get to know this person is this the right person and for you to take time meet people like for me for the last five years before we started dating i met a lot a lot of people and meet people of the opposite gender if you have a, you have you are, you are a guy meet people meet ladies like try to see like if this is the person i want to live with like will she be able like to to just like um hata nikubali nikiwa vile niko ama maybe at some point tafika maybe we have con- conflicts and if you are a lady like talk to uh, talk to guys like just know people because at, at some point that is when you will come to realize who suits you best because mimi for the last five years i was like in friendship with her and also in friendship with other people like just friendship and i was be able to uh, i was able like kukuja kuona like ah we are twenty who we are twenty like I just did my own elimination in my mind to pole 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 and I was like now we'll never date but I I believe that God is the one who brought her back to me and it it needs time for you to date because yeah. this is a person you're going to spend the whole life with you and you you don't want to spend time with and somebody and who And the way dating mm. like for me all my life dating has never been a thing of 
as in let's just date and see where it goes. Mm. It's mm. a marriage thing. That's why he's saying this is the person you're going to spend the rest of your life with. Mm. You know, he's not talking about marriage. He's talking about dating. You're seeing this person, this person in your future. Mm. So if you don't see this person like 10 years from now, 15 years from now, maybe you have having kids with them mm. don't don't date them don't yeah. date mm. them take time just take your time mm. like there's one thing that i usually use it's called leave your level per time like if 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 it's something that you need to to work on work on it poly poly don't rush because that's when you that's why you, we are seeing a lot a lot of things happening out there we are seeing killings suicides we are seeing like uh, families breaking we are seeing a lot of things happening and you find these people maybe you have met with someone and you have not spent time with this person mm -hmm. to know if you can be able to manage to stay with this person like for the rest of your life yeah. even if my partner to not feel he or she is the right person take your time get to know this person well are you ready to s to spend time with them mm. start with friendship basically mm. don't just don't just run into a relationship start with friendship maybe for a year or two mm. and then know this person from a friends level and then mm. now you can you can be more than that but mm. mostly just pray to god about it yeah god pray. is the one who guides you mm. god will guide you into meeting the right person because you know people can be so weird out yeah. here mm. this nairobi <laughs> <laughs> Lisa has taught me like, how to be patient with people and two, like lowering my ego. Like I think those are the two most important things. If you learn to be patient with someone and you also you learn like to sacrifice yourself for the happiness of the other person. Like you know, when I sacrifice myself for her, she also sacrificed myself herself for me. So like solving disagreements for us, like we have first to understand each other. And one thing that we usually say to ourselves, like we cannot move out of a conversation or an argument without a solution. That's yeah. one. Like of course those are things that like break relationships. Mimi ni memkosea and then we have argued and then after the argument, kila mtu amenda njaya, njaya yake. Yeye amenda amenyamaza anasema ah sitaim text time to call. Wacha yeye atani call ama atani text. Yeah. Anangoja mi nango, nangoja. At the end of it all, aduta why communicate. Mm -hmm. And that's where the mm, mm, like, that's where now the break comes mm -hmm. and then you start drifting from each other. Mm -hmm. So me na feel like um what the the, the major important thing that has helped us is lowering our ego and also ensuring that we solve a solution we get an a solution to an argument right there and then. Like sisi tukianza ku argue sai the next one, atakama to argue for the, the rest of the day, we will not come out of that argument without a solution. And then now we say, kama ni mekosea, pole. Kama me pole. And then now we push together, yeah. It's just about understanding each other.